the boat. What are you doing? Cleaning up. I mean, you got to make a mess to, to clean, so that's what all this stuff's for. You do the first thing very well. Yeah, make a mess. Yeah. Yeah, I'm good at that. Came to this dock last year. Um, it's a bit naughty of me because it's not really a marine or anything. It's just kind of docked to land. So yeah, we've just done it again. It took us a while to get in, uh, but now that we're in, it's perfect. Marine shops are just there. Restaurants are just there. Main city's just a bus ride away. <laughs> After five long days and four much longer nights, arriving in Malta was exactly what we needed. The sail was both of our biggest crossings to date. What do you think of Malta? Pretty good. Not bad? Not bad. I'm surprised. What's your favorite spot slash building? Would you say right here? Right here. Right here. There we are. Yeah. So last year I was here I missed this spot so I'm quite happy to discover some new little spots around the place. Quite tired from the five day sail <laughs> but uh, we're gonna have another good sleep tonight and uh, recover and recuperate. <laughs> Sailing in the Med for five months over summer left Merriweather with many jobs to be done. Malta is an amazing place to tick off all the little jobs that had been built up. Yes? What you doing? Um, making a mess. I'm changing the oil, first time I've ever done that. Done a bit of YouTubing this afternoon and yeah, she's going well. She's going very well. Jobs included servicing the engine, taking down the sails for repair, waterproofing the boat, and climbing the mast to re-rope the jib halyard. Exploring Malta, we quickly learned that it had some unique qualities. Malta is the fifth most densely populated Severian country. Valletta, its capital, is the smallest capital in the European Union. Malta, being in the middle of the Mediterranean, has had inhabitants since 5900 BC. The country has been ruled over the years by many different emperors. Some include Romans, Arabs and British. Malta inquired independence in 1964. Okay, and we have just gone for a little walk around the uh, old town of, uh, of Valletta. Uh, we're off the beaten track a little bit. There's definitely no buses that come to where we are and we've just found this little garden. It's, it's not bad, is it? It's beautiful. Um, we are one couple of two in the whole garden. It's unreal, there's nobody here and we got the whole place to ourselves. Yeah, found a little gem, love it. What have you done? Just um, picked some lemons. Pick some or stole some? Well, the tree was there, and uh, that, that's your tree. Oh, I didn't recognize it. It's the people's tree. It's the people's tree. Oh, oh, okay. Fair enough. <laughs> Hello, mate. Do you have a chicken plus fizzy? Yes. Can I get one, please? Just compare yourself to you. I didn't compare myself to anybody. They made a statue of me. Made a 
statue of the Messiah, which is me, mm. so I've, I've come. Can, can you see the resemblance? Like, look at this. And I just got a crown that goes like this. And looking all over the people. Okay, we have left the boat um, this morning to check out one of Malta's most, I guess say, most famous spots. It's called the Blue Grotto. Uh, there's a bunch of tourists about, so we're going to try and avoid them. But yeah, let's see how it is. going to get the most delicious thing Malta has to offer. It's called a patizzi. It's 60 cents. It's got chicken, pastry and mushrooms. Oh, it's my favorite thing in the world. Empty out the old strappy chair. Chicken. Hey mate. Could I please get, if I get four patizzi, four chicken ones, how much is that? Chicken 60. Sorry? 60 Can I get two more? So six all up. Legend, thank you. Thank you, thank you so there. much. Six. Mm. Good. Amazing. After leaving Malta, we continued to film our adventures into Pantelleria, Italy. But unfortunately, one of our cards got corrupted, losing a lot of footage. We visited the so-called hot springs of the island located in the beautiful Lake di Veneri. I was looking forward to something like really hot mm. to warm me up. Mm. But I want to scrub it as lukewarm. The uh, volcano needs to get to action. watching guys please join us next time when we cross to a new continent and explore the diamond in the rough that is tunisia as always like and subscribe and if you really want to help us out become a patron in the link below